Hi, my name is Jamie. Welcome to Border Bananas. Today I am participating in a cleaning and decor hop hosted by my friend Nicole, North Garden Home and Garden. Uh, today I am going to be doing my hutch. At the end of this video, there will be a link to the next participant in this collaboration. Just click on that link and it'll take you to the next video. And then what um, they will have a link in their description box going to the next video and it'll be a big circle so once you come around to me you'll know that you have finished the hop so if you are interested in these kinds of videos we're all doing different kind of spaces in our home so there's lots of motivation and inspiration for you to get something clean and decorated for um, your home so if you're interested in these kinds of videos Please stick around and don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe button and let's get cleaning. I'm doing my hutch. I've gathered all of my creamy white dishes, a few of my vintage blue and white dishes, some green objects that I love. Um, and all of this is thrifted, of course, except for um, a couple of things. Let's see if I can find them. These little guys are Syracuse China personal teapots that my mother sent me um, that she thrifted for 75 cents a piece. But I think everything else I thrifted or grew. <laughs> so this is just a quick overview of some of the things that I've gathered. Uh, my heritage, of course, some crystal shiny sparkly things, a DIY, and I love decorating with beautiful, useful things like these kitchen towels that I have been collecting and ref for refreshing my own home. So, and then some old vintage books. Like most people, I like to start with a nice and shiny clean surface. And the shelves on my hutch are glass, so I'm using spray away for that. It smells really good and it does a nice job, so I really like that one. And then to just give the wood a quick dusting, uh, I'm using just a Dollar Tree wood polish or wood cleaner um, and my hutch is black so it shows every little piece of lint or dust uh, which I don't mind so much but I definitely my hutch has seen better days so it definitely needs a new paint job soon so look forward to that. Here I had to add some books to ensure that my tray doesn't fall down in the back because of that uh, support beam in the back there. Um, and the book holds it still. And then added my newly propagated pothos. This bowl is the largest mixing bowl in the, my heritage pattern. I'm still looking for the medium and the small.
I like to start from back to front, adding levels as I go and layers. Um, but in the end, I end up taking away one of the plates on each side of the top. It took me a while to get here, but I am very, very pleased with the way that this has turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check the description box for the link to the next video. There is going to be lots and lots of cleaning and decorating motivation and inspiration for you today. I also like to thank Nicole North Garden Home and Garden for uh, hosting this challenge. Her link to her channel will also be in the description box. So if you'd like to go check her out as well, you won't be disappointed. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to click the thumbs up and subscribe too. Gotta get that in there. <laughs> Thanks guys. Bye, check you later.